We thought long and hard about what it means for Seneca to be fronting this year's Greek of Legends tournament. And it was only right that this legend sitting next to me here should pick the opening race. For me, there was only ever one choice, a place that means so much to me. For this tournament, I've handpicked a roster of cars that, if I do say so myself, is very, very nice. We've invited all of last season's top teams to compete. And one by one, we're going to eliminate them. No guts, no glory. <laughs> been watching a race and thought, you know what would make this race better? Another race. We'll wonder no more. Drivers will be separated into different vehicle classes, with each group competing for their own victory. Try to keep your eyes peeled, because where there's more races, there's more drama, higher stakes and bigger battles. Don't even think about blinking, because there'll be a whole lot to keep track of. I'm going to need a good lie down after this one. With the tournament pressing on, it's looking like a few of our teams are putting a heap of pressure on the previous grid champions, Seneca. North Point have impressed with some great performances, pushing ahead of Seneca in the standings. I'd expect to see some form of retaliation from Seneca in the next few races in a bid to steal that top spot. really pulled it together, pushing in front of Raven West these past few races, which I'm sure they're pleased about. They're really trying to climb those standings, but the way Vaults have been performing recently, Seneca are going to have to work a little harder to steal that first place position from them. Well done, champ. Medal looks good on you. These are t-shirts as well. I got them printed. Nancy, hey. what's your t-shirt size? I knew this was a good decision. See you back at the garage? 